On October 30 last year, a suspension bridge in Morbi collapsed. 135 people were killed in the incident and several were injured. The Gujarat government then appointed a special investigation team to look into the incident. The SIT has found in its preliminary probe that corrosion on nearly half of the wires on a cable and welding of old suspenders with new ones were some of the major faults that led to the collapse of the suspension bridge. These findings are part of the preliminary report on Morbi Bridge incident submitted by the five-member SIT in November 2020. The report was recently shared with the Morbi municipality by the State Urban Development Department. Oreva Group's Ajanta Manufacturing Limited was responsible for the operation and maintenance of the British era suspension bridge on the Machu River. The SIT noted that of the two main cables of the bridge, one cable was having issues of corrosion and nearly half of its wire may be already broken even before the cable snapped. According to the SIT, the main cable on the upstream side of the river snapped, leading to the tragedy. The SIT also found that during the renovation work, old suspenders were welded with the new suspenders. In these types of bridges, single rod suspenders should be used to bear the load. Notably, the Morbi municipality, without the approval of the general board, had awarded the contract to maintain and operate the bridge to Ajanta Manufacturing Limited. The company had closed the bridge in March 2022 for renovation and opened it on October 26 without any prior approval or inspection. According to the SIT, there were nearly 300 persons on the bridge at the time of the collapse, which was far more than the load-bearing capacity of the bridge. The probe report also pointed out that replacing individual wooden planks with an aluminium deck also played a role in the collapse. The Morbi police have already arrested 10 accused, including Oreva Group's MD, Jaisuk Patel.